Hi, I'm Ned Russin. I play bass and I sing in a band called Tidal Fight from Kingston, Pennsylvania. And this is a story about how music has saved my life. My older brother started playing in bands at a young age when he was 14 or 15, and I'm seven years younger than him. And uh, so I was, you know, very impressionable and, and uh, very interested in what my brother was doing. And, and the first show that I ever went to was when I was seven years old. It was at a fire hall in, in my hometown of Kingston. And uh, he put together a show for my cousin who had been in an accident. It was a benefit show. And uh, his band played. They were called Dermicious Canids. And there was a bunch of local bands uh, like Bedford and Magnus and Eight Ounce Joe and all these bands that I'd seen flyers of on his wall and, and heard him talking about with his friends. And, and so I went with it. And, and from there, my interest just grew and grew. And, and uh, myself and my brother and, and some friends, we started this band when we were 12 years old. And it went from being something that we did for fun on the weekends to now we're traveling across the country and across the world and then doing everything that we've never thought we'd be able to do. And it's, it's taught me so much about, about everything from myself to how I view the world around me and how I view people around me. And uh, it's giving me a, a place where I can go and I feel comfortable within myself and around my peers to express how I feel. It's giving me that sense of comfort that I've, uh, you know, anybody strives for their entire life. And I think so many people look at it as a strange community where, you know, people go around and a bunch of big tough guys beating the crap out of each other and doing stuff like that. And when people look at it like that, I view it, view it as this beautiful thing that has come out of anger and frustration and put it into a positive thing. And I think so many people they can't find the right outlet for that and that's why you know people go to bars and they get in fights and they do all this stuff and while people were doing that and kids in my high school were going to parties and getting messed up and, and doing that kind of stuff my friends and I opted to go to shows and, and talk about you know things that we liked and bands that we liked and, and then we started writing our own music and talking about how we were feeling and getting that out to the world and uh, it's something that it's, it's uh, hard to, to match the feeling that you get Honestly, my life has been very unstructured. You know, uh, we're on the road the majority of the year. We're in different places every night, playing different cities and, and doing all this different stuff. But the one thing that I always feel is consistent throughout my life is music and my love for music and playing music and all this stuff. And, you know, um, while things happen and, and things change and maybe sometimes for the better and sometimes for the worse, there's always that consistency of knowing that I enjoy doing one thing and that's playing music and it goes beyond just enjoying the music it's it's you know expressing how i feel and uh you know really using that as a you know as a, just my way of of kind of dealing and, and coping with things